All right, Dixie chapter of the Tear Jerkers is having their meeting in Savannah, Georgia, out in Skidaway Park, and we are on our way. We just went through Jacksonville, Florida. We left this morning at 7 a.m., and we're looking at getting there about 5 p.m. tonight, and we are super excited for this trip. We've been talking about it for months, and uh, we're going to have good weather. It's not going to be hot. It's not going to be raining. A little bit of overcast here and there, so I think the conditions are going to be perfect for a camp out. So, um, just giving you an update of where we're at, where we're heading, and we're going to be setting up camp here in about an hour. Yep. So. You can see the canoe in the on top of the camper behind us. It's kind of like a cheeseburger. <laughs> Probably doesn't taste like a cheeseburger. All right, we'll catch up with you later. trip we made our trip out to Skidaway Park in Savannah Georgia and we've had a awesome time with the Dixie chapter of tear jerkers mm -hmm. they're an awesome group of people to be with this is our second time meeting up with them and um, our very first time out in the camper we went to a tear jerkers event and it was at Cheehaw State Park where we initially <laughs> met most of the people 
And now we have met up with them again out in Savannah, Georgia. And we have a couple more meetings that are, I guess we got something hitting our roof. And we made some new friends, so. Yeah, and people that we consider friends. Like, these are people we're going to continue to make contact with. Um, chat on Facebook and, and text back and forth and set up future mm -hmm. camping trips with. If you're interested in getting involved in the teardrop community, I highly recommend the tear jerkers as a group of people to uh, associate yourself with. Ultra friendly. Um, when you go to the groups, like Friday night when you first get there, or Thursday night when you first get mm -hmm. there, usually it's a Thursday through Sunday type thing. Um, they meet up with the director, and his name is Jeff, goes by Grizz, and um, meet over at his campsite do an introductory to all the new campers that you know their first time there so we'll go around the fire pit and introduce ourselves so that the new people that are attending can uh, get adjusted and familiar with the people that you're camping with and then uh, there's usually snacks and food there that night and then each night they do a gathering about six o'clock and a yard sale a camper's yard sale to trade stuff back and forth and we have a really good time just sitting around the campfire mm -hmm. late in the evening eating a meal use a potluck everybody bring a meal and uh, it's a really good time we enjoy it we enjoy making these trips and meeting up with these people and hanging out and getting to know um, people and getting to know some of the new people that come around skidway park was really pretty there's a lot of trees with a lot of moss hanging it, it reminds me a little bit of um Louisiana, you know. How it reminds me of a classic setting in Savannah, Georgia, <laughs> with your live oak trees and the wow. and the uh, the moss That's hanging beautiful. from the trees. It's the epitome of what Savannah, Georgia, really is—a mm -hmm. true Southern uh, feel to it. And uh, the second night we were there around the campfire, and a deer came right up to our uh, to the yeah. edge of the woods, right where we were yeah, at. Yeah, that was really neat. Yeah. And then uh, Saturday, uh, yes, no, Friday morning, we got up and we went to Tybee Island. We took a tour of Tybee Island, the lighthouse, and the fort that's there. And we saw everything there and we went later on. It was really pretty. <clears throat> and uh, ate a meal. So you just kind of went out on yourself and ate a meal. And um, we came on back. And then we walked around. Was it that, that day that we walked around and visited? No. Uh Saturday. Saturday. Saturday, we went on um, a, walk, a little hike. A nature trail mm -hmm. walk that was there at the park. It was about a mile long hike. Mm -hmm. And uh, that was a lot of fun, just meeting and talking with everyone through the through the woods. And mm -hmm. um, it wasn't too overly hot. It was hot. It was hot, but it wasn't mm -hmm. uh, stupid hot. <laughs> so then after the, the hike, we uh, went around and Got had an opportunity to look at everybody's camper, so we'll probably. Um, we're put going to in, show you a few yeah, clips of some of the campers. Some, some of the campers that we did look at that we didn't see before. Some most of them we saw before. So now you're also going to see some like A frames and some regular travel trailers. These are people who have been in the teardrop community for a while, and even though they don't have a teardrop, they may have sold it. They continue to camp with the teardroppers. Because it's such a great... It's a tight community. You know, it's really good. Group of people. Yeah, they're really nice. I really enjoy hanging out with this group of mm -hmm. people. And uh, we really enjoyed ourselves. And uh, four days at a Tear Jerkers event is just too short. Yeah. And it's not high pace. When you wake up, you just get your breakfast. And usually about 9 or 10 o'clock before the, the first little walk or the little venture out. Mm -hmm. And then you come back and you do something... And then later on that evening, you get together for your meal. So you got time for naps. You got time to go out and shop the community or visit the community mm -hmm. and do what you want to do. And you don't have to feel rushed to get back and participate in the evening event. We really enjoyed it. Yeah. Now, there are other people that were interested in, in doing a kayak and canoe thing, but that never really kicked off because we thought water was going to be right there at the park, and it wasn't. Mm -hmm. So we didn't. Still a nice park, though. I Oh yeah. I give it a really good review. Uh, oh, I yeah. would go again. It's really nice. It was moderately clean, mm -hmm. good bathrooms, good showers. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, we've been to better, but 
they yeah. were they were good. They were, they were it decent. was a really good port. It wasn't awful, so <laughs> and the new the the event center, what was the name of that that welcoming center that they have at the park? That thing was brand new. It was a gift, it was a shop. gift shop in mm-hmm. there. It was really nice. Phenomenal. Mm-hmm. Like ten out of ten for that that place. Yeah. That was really good. And um yeah, we really enjoyed ourselves and we can't wait for our next event. So is there anything else you want to add to it? Or want well, to I hope you enjoy the little bit of footage that we did get. So we didn't get a lot. Um, sometimes we just find ourselves busy, you know, hanging out with people and doing other... And actually just enjoying our time there. And we forget, oh yeah, we need to make a video. So <laughs> It's hard to, <laughs> because it's so purpose-driven doing these videos. You have to make it a point to do it. Mm-hmm. And so they never turn out as detailed as we would like them to but we're, we're getting better so we're i hope you enjoyed it get a little bit better every time so all right well thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next adventure Okay, well, we're in our camper. We're camping. Savannah. Well, Skidaway Island.